my goodness. Okay, my energy changing streak might be coming to a close. It might be coming to an end. Like my energy, like I haven't changed energy on a lot of sneakers this year, but it might stop on this in particular pair, man. Ah, I was doing so good, shawty. I was doing so good. What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Mike Rich, man. What's happening with y'all today? I hope everybody eat, each and every one of y'all is having, oh, I said eat, you heard the eat in there. Hope y'all having a blessed day today, man. Today, happy Thanksgiving, happy day off of work. For me, it's just day off of work that I just get to sit back and eat. But really, I'm gonna work because I'm gonna be doing YouTube videos and editing and stuff on this day off of work so I can utilize my time wisely, I guess. But anyway, today, man, like, I hope y'all eating good. You want to watch this while you're eating, when you want to watch this while you're chilling, kicking back, getting something to drink. You want to step aside from the football games that's on today to watch your boy Rich. I keep watching, wiping my forehead because I'm sweating a little bit. You know what I'm saying? But anyway, man, early sneaker. Um, on YouTube, early don't even mean early no more. Like, oh, this is early for the consumer. This is early for the people who just buy shoes on a regular basis, don't get early shoes all the time. But on YouTube, if you get a shoe a week or two early, you really late because everybody else on YouTube, they got the shoe two months early. But it's early for y'all, for most of y'all anyway. It's an early sneaker. So let's go ahead and see what they look like. I might have changed my energy. Let's see for sure because I peeked in the box a little bit. And I was like, whoa, I might have to cop these. Now I was like, let me go ahead and get them early, do a quick little review on them, and give them back to my guy Retro, Retro Rick. I be getting all my little early stuff so I can do the reviews, so I don't have to pay the money to buy them unless I absolutely want them. This be the Retro be giving me the test. He, that's the test, man. He always tests me to see if I'm gonna change my energy. And on this pair right here, your boy Rich, <laughs> the energy might have been changed. I, I peeked in the box. I still haven't really looked at the shoe in hand yet, but my energy might has has been changed about this shoe. My first thing when I saw the shoe pictures and stuff like that, I was like, that colorway, oh, that colorway. Oh. So anyway, uh, after my couple of uh, colorway growls, let's go ahead and see what shoe I'm talking about. And some of y'all probably guessed it already. It is these, ooh, they upside down. Turn them back right. Ooh, shiny things. Tap dance, show day. Yeah, these things glistening, boy. Vaseline, boy. Uh, so, patent leather Jordan ones. Real quick about patent leather Jordan ones. I pretty much sold every patent leather Jordan one that I had in my collection, except for the Jordan one shattered backboard. The, the, the patent leather shattered backboard 3.0, which ain't really a shattered backboard, but um, man, I'm just. Oof, the pen, there's nothing about pen leather. They get dusty quick, like the paper, paper particles is on this one right here. Yeah, bow. The Air Jordan One. What is it? What, what, what we call these pen leather? We call these black and gold. What are we calling these? New Orleans Saints. Uh, it says uh, metallic gold, black metallic gold. That's the colorway. So. Metallic gold thing. I got that light right there, so I'm trying to I'm trying to let the light shine on it too much because but these right here, if nothing else, they shiny. Uh, <laughs> but in hand, the colorway, the gold against the black hit really nice. I didn't realize that the gold stitching was around the uh midsole right there. I didn't realize that when I saw it from the pictures and stuff like that. And the reason I say my energy has changed because when I first saw this shoe, I was like, man. The black midsole killed it for me. If you're gonna do an all black patent leather Jordan one, I want to at least have the midsole be white with a gold bottom. That's what I wanted on the shoe. But after seeing it in the hand, man, I don't know. These are super clean. Look at the, this is what I'm really feeling right here. Look at the gold winged logo right there. That thing looking, woo. As the old heads say, that thing looking sharp right there. It looking sharp. So like I said, uh, black patent leather upper got your gold wing logo. You got your gold swooshes uh, Same kind of gold look like that's on the uh, the gold toes Which like I said, I sold I, every patent leather Jordan one I had I've sold it itself for the shadow back boy 3.0s all my patent leather Jordan ones are gone But look at these woof And they shine man, and I think the reason I got rid of most of them because of the stiffness 
Um, the pan leather is stiff. I haven't really broke broken in any of my pan leather Jordan 1, so maybe that stiffness kind of, y'all can come blow, see if it actually breaks in a little bit, that stiffness on them. But y'all come blow and tell me that, because I haven't even gave them, most of my Jordan 1 pan leathers, I haven't even gave them enough time to see if they, um, if they give a little bit. But, um, you got the, that, that uh, swoosh on the Nike tongue right there, the Nike, that gold Nike Air swoosh. I mean, tab reminds me of um, gum bottom Jordan 1s that I had a long time ago, and I sold them too because the quality was terrible on them, man. Like, they was just stiff, hurting my feet, and it was just it was just a real, real stiff shoe. The toe was wrinkling up like crazy. That's what that, but that's what that reminds me of, that uh, gold color against the black on the tongue. On the inside, of course, I already figured that. I didn't even see it, but I figured that it would be uh, black with the gold Nike Air on it. Bottoms is black, but the shoe is dope. It, um, uh, retail is $170. I don't even know when this sneaker released. It will come out this weekend or next weekend. I don't even know. So these actually release on, uh, it says November 30th, which is uh, Cyber Monday. So I guess these gonna be the new Cyber Monday Jordan 1s. I don't know, man. So y'all comment below and tell me what y'all think of these. I think they are clean. They do come with uh, extra laces. As most of the OG highs do come with extra laces and they come with the gold. And I would definitely like, if I've copped this shoe, I would definitely go with the gold laces for the simple fact that um, the shoe just is so mo it's just mostly black. And I think them gold laces, when you put them gold laces on there, I think that'll make the shoe pop. Um, you still got some tap dancing vibes because of that all black pan leather. It still got some uh, fry cook vibes going on with them. It's just something about an all black patent leather shoe. First thing coming up, like marching band, tap dancing, dress shoes. My wife really, really likes this shoe. She digs this shoe. She want a pair of these for herself. I'm gonna try to see if I can't even, if I don't go after myself a pair, I'm gonna at least try to go after that size seven and a half or eight uh, for, my, for my wife to get her a pair of these, man. She really been digging the Jordan ones lately. And these are cleansed in my humble opinion, so I'm gonna go and hit them with that clank, 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 cleansed in my most humble, oh so humble opinion, man. So like I said, y'all comment below and tell me what y'all think of these. Y'all going after these, you sleeping, you keeping, you like them, you think they trash can water? You think they trash can water? Comment below and let me know. Not quite trash can water. I won't say that they are cleansed. I would actually wear their shoe. I don't know if I would keep it. I don't know if after a long day of having these on, my feet gonna be hurting, my dog gonna be barking. I have no idea, but um, I think these are nice, man. So anyway, y'all comment below and tell me what y'all think. Definitely would go with the gold laces with these things. Uh, y'all hit that thumbs up, like, subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already. Hit the notification bell so you can become a part of Rich Nation. Stand all the way up there to the moon on them. You feel me? And keep watching my video, cause that's what I'm here for. Gone.